what kind of what kind of bird you got there? Um, he's a hybrid. He's three quarters peregrine falcon, one quarter jew falcon, and uh, I think he's the biggest, baddest bird in the world. This is Percy. He's a half greyhound, half Australian shepherd. Very loyal, very hardworking dog. And he loves the rabbits, don't you, Percy? And then what about uh, the other? She's a half Tazi, which is a Central Asian running dog. Uh, quarter greyhound and quarter border collie. And her name is? Gobi. What I'm thinking of doing is hunting the, these four corners. And I think you, you'll be able to see everything from here. Hopefully we're going to get to run out in the pivot. There's not a lot of jacks here, but when you get them, you get a good chase. All right. You're ready to go, aren't you, fella? He's itching to go. He understands that the dogs help him. Um, he's totally ungrateful on the kill, and he will probably beat the dogs up. Um, his special move is to come in and hit the jackrabbit right in front of the dogs and knock it over. He knows he's got the dogs there to help him finish it. Oh, Okay, who wants to just run for a tire pile? Up, 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 That was rather comical, uh, long winging there. Some things are just too funny not to do. You know, catching cottontails out of tire piles with a tail peregrine, it's just kind of surreal. It's always best that it gets right up and the dogs are chasing it straight away because then you don't have that lag. So the dogs are burning energy trying to get to the chase. And Zell's pretty good at like engaging the jackrabbit and getting it going in circles so they can catch up. So not a lot of people do this with dogs. Why, why, why do you think that is? Um, I think it's just a weird idea to a lot of falconers to fly a falcon, uh, rabbits, you know. Um, but it's actually very, very traditional. It's been done for thousands of years. And in Asia and the Middle East, it's still practiced regularly. But it seems kind of weird to people over here who are sort of grown up with you fly falcons and have them waiting on over grouse, you know, and, or ducks, and that's the way you do it. But I don't have any grouse. Or, where I live and very few ducks, so it makes more sense to hunt jackrabbits, there's lots of those.
Kind of surprised we didn't catch that one. Are you, are you give him a break or are you going to keep going? Well, the dogs need a break. 